Welcome to habit six of Stephen Covey's Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. We've got pigeons, we've got the village waking up, we've got the sparrows joining us today. There'll probably be cars, planes, boats, who knows? Might be flying elephants. And that's kind of in tune with today's message and this strange hat. Because habit six is about synergy, about the idea that you don't have to be the rugged pioneer. What you need to do is to work with other people. In fact, you don't have to wear all the hats. In fact, it's even better news than that. You shouldn't wear all the hats. There will be one hat that you will wear that will be your hat your style. I know it's not exactly Terry Pratchett's hat here, but there's that kind of Terry Pratchett moment there. He had that amazing hat that was just Terry Pratchett. Synergy is about deliberately seeking out the right kind of people to synergize your business so that one plus one equals three or five or seven or nine. See what I did there? Um, you can do it all on your own. You can be the rugged pioneer. We, ha we live in a society where the technology and everything is there to help you run every aspect of your business, but you will never thrive. The model I use is a tripod. You will have a focus to your business where you want to be highly effective, hence the seven habits of highly effective people. But that will need to be supported by three legs. One of those legs could be you but there will be two others. And one of the challenges I have is that everybody expects everything for free on the internet. Whereas the cost of getting this training, and this training, and all the years of experience is very expensive. So there's a disconnect there. Let's begin then by pacing what you expect, which is to have everything for free. 16, the number 16, personalities.com is an amazing site where you can pay for some of the reports, but at the point of contact, you can get an excellent free profile of your Myers-Briggs type indicator. That will tell you more about you, your focus, and that first leg. It will give you some ideas about who else you need to synergize with to really be highly effective, uh, but not much. And then if you like what you've seen over these episodes, I mean, we are pushing 30 episodes now. This is nearly a month's worth of content. If you like the cut of my jib, I don't know what that means, but if you do, I have to pay for these licenses, but they are very powerfully focused on your future. So this one here is the contribution compass where we will discover, we will know for certain, and that's a beautiful thing, whether you're the catalyst or the champion or the coach or the connector or the custodian, the cultivator, the conductor, or the calibrator. More than that, once we know for certain where your strengths lie, we can then say the minimum two other legs you need to the tripod of your future success will be, and there's a pattern I can follow and know for certain. I do like that word certain today. And then one of the big challenges in life is running out of fuel. I suppose you've, um, you've experienced this yourself. You've done a project and you've suddenly run out of energy. Ugh. And so you can't quite complete it. Well, we need to be completer finishers in this race of life. So to synergize, not only do we need to find the right people to work with, we need to find the right energies to fuel them. So this is my course notes from Motivational Mapping, which will look at nine energies, fuels, that will get you victory. And again, I have to pay for those profiles, so can't offer you that one for free. I'm gonna keep it quite short today. I just want you to get excited about not doing it all alone, finding at least two other people. You don't have to employ them. You don't even have to go into partnership with them, but you need to work with them, two other people who will synergize your success so that you can be in flow 80% of the time where your strengths lie 
and that's a recipe to live long and prosper because you're going to be happy if you're doing what you're naturally good at it feels good but if you have to wear the other hats as well it will drain your energy and uh, diminish your joie de vivre so do yourself a favor start with 16personalities.com find out what myers-briggs type you are tell me so that i may get to know you better and uh, if you're seeing this on youtube please subscribe and click on the notifications bell so that we can keep the momentum going if you come across it through facebook and linkedin which are my portals to youtube remember there's a youtube channel dedicated to productivity i've put productivity on it because that's a word that people search for it's really about happiness it's about living a life to the full where your life is full of love and doing the things you love with the people that you love what could be better thank you pigeons thank you sparrows thank you lorry thank you viewers i love you have an awesome